Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows a mass in Morrison's pouch. You can see the liver. The posterior right subhepatic space, also known as hepatorenal fossa or Morrison's pouch, separates the liver from the right kidney. Now you can see the patient is a child, male child, aged about five and a half years. And you can see the liver, right kidney and a mass in between the lower pole of the kidney and liver that is in the Morrison's pouch. Dark masses around Morrison's pouch may originate from the right adrenal as I think in this case an adrenal mass seen in the Morrison's pouch. So the large masses in the Morrison's pouch are in or around the Morrison's pouch may originate from the right adrenal, right kidney, right lobe of liver, retroperitoneum or peritoneum. A wide variety of neoplasm occur around the Morrison's pouch. The knowledge of imaging characters of these lesions and anatomical landmarks allow the accurate diagnosis. Now you can see the blood flow. A significant blood flow is seen in the kidney, liver and the mass. The mass is round to oval in shape, is semi-solid to solid in consistency. No fluid is seen in or around the mass. Morrison's pouch is a space between the liver and right kidney that's only visible on an ultrasound when it fills with fluid. The pathology with, within the Morrison's pouch can be either an abdominal collection of fluid such as blood, ascetic fluid, pus or soft tissue masses. Now the Morrison's pouch boundaries are the interior boundary consists of right hepatic lobe and gallbladder. Posteriorly there is right kidney, right adrenal gland, the second, mar uh, second part of duodenum, hepatic flexure and pancreatic head. The transverse mesocolumn lies inferiorly. Now the Morrison space is the area between the liver and right kidney also called the hepatorenal recess or right subhepatic space. Morrison's pouch is a potential space that can open up when fluid or blood enters the area. Mild systemic diseases such as inflammatory bowel disease IBD is another potential cause of small effusion. If the amount of fluid is minimum anechoic and there is no evidence of abdominal disease, it is more likely to be a benign cause. Now you can see the liver, right kidney and the mass, mass in the Morrison's pouch. You can find some important information in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel. If you do like this video, please click the like button. Thanks.